Hello, I want to say welcome to the Point No Code channel where I teach you how to build everything with No Code. With how to build your own product, how to launch SaaS, web application, yeah, everything that No Code can, no code can build. Today, I want to show you how to build your first SaaS using Card and Airtable. These two, these two tools are very, very cool. They come highly recommended all the time and they're very, very affordable. So if you follow me from now to the end of this tutorial, I'm going to show you how you can start your own first product without learning any um, complex no code to and without writing any complex codes and you can have your, your first SaaS product up and running. So you want to get started? Let's do this. So this is card. If you're wondering what this is, this is card. I'm going to go back and show you um, how card, uh, the landing page for card, right? So this is the landing page for card. And what it says is that you can just build anything that you want to build. So mostly you would use card to build a one page out website, like maybe lead generation website or your own personal portfolio website, or, you know, a landing page that you can use to try pretty much anything and everything. So for example, when I want to create lead generation pages, I always come around to use card. I don't really bother hosting my websites on very expensive um, um, website builder, but I just come around to and use card. And also, if I want to try out um, a, an idea, if I want to try out an idea, I use card. So card is very cool. It enables you to build a page on the internet where you can redirect people to. Because this thing, there's this thing about traffic. If you're pulling a whole lot of traffic from different places and you're not directing those traffic somewhere, it's going to be really useless. So even though it's possible for you to direct your traffic to your Twitter account, but you will not be able to automate this process, right? But with card, you are able to build a place, you know, a site on the internet where you can redirect people to. So I'm going to show you some of the things I've built before. Um, so if you follow my YouTube channel, you would see that I have all this, um, all this stuff for free, you know, AI business idea, Catalyst Able, high Combating Landing Page Template. So all these are built with uh, card, right? So now you want to build your own so I would definitely advise you to use card so you don't spend so much money so you can try out plenty and uh, you know you can try out tons of idea without actually breaking the bank so let's go to the meat of this thing when you want to build it when I um, you want to start with your first house I was going to advise um, first time solopreneur especially those persons who are in the so software service niche to build a you know build a directory you know, build a directory or build a list of something that you can put behind a paywall and just charge for it, right? It's not really complex. Build a database, you know, build a database of something. For example, you can build a database of um, hotels in your area. You can build a database of um, roles. You know, when I mean roles, I mean uh, a particular industry that's always hiring. You can build a database of nurses and jobs for nurses. You can build a database of virtually anything. For example, there's this particular product that I launched a while ago. It's a database containing directories that where you can um, launch your product, right? Uh, this, this is what it contains. It contains like the name of the directory, the domain authority, the link, and the type, right? So if you click in between, you would see it's just forms that I had to fill. Right, these are just forms that I had to fill and nothing else. So what I did was that I came here to Airtable. So meanwhile, if you're wondering what this is, this is Airtable. Airtable is a very, very cool tool uh, for creating database and uh, you know spreadsheet-like applications. So this is Airtable right here, and I call this product Product Launch Heaven because people are always looking for where to uh, launch their product. So I call this product Product, product Launch Heaven and. Um, People, uh, they can. People who 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 pay or you know get it from one promotion or the other, they can come here and see what I have in stuff for them, right? So what I'm actually saving people, I'm saving them time. You know, it takes time for you to find all these directory yourself if you want to if you want to find it. It takes time, or you can pay somebody on Canva. But if I do this research for you and I give it to you, like maybe nineteen dollars, nineteen dollars for this particular this particular uh, spreadsheet, you will like it because it's cheaper than what you get on Fiverr. And it's cheaper. It's going to save your time if you're doing it yourself. So right here, I have international list. I have local.
local list and I have, you know, I just have lists where you can gain a lot of authority because when a lot of freelancers or indie hackers build their SaaS products, they are looking for where to, where they will post, post the link of their product so that it will, Google will rank their website a whole lot. Right, so this is the tool that I'm going to sell, and this is where I, this is where I'm going to create a landing page to sell this particular this particular product. So meanwhile, I'm calling it product product launch heaven. So what I'll do is that I'll come here and I'll just create a new site. Right, um, if you don't want to spend so much time trying to create yours, it's fine. So you can pick from any of the template that you have here. Right, you can pick for any, from any of the templates, and um, I'm going to find a template to pick for the sake of this tutorial right now um so let me look for one that it's a bit sassy um i'm looking for one okay let's go up here and use landing so we can see something like this this is a bit playful right <clears throat> okay i'm looking for something cool okay i think this is cool so i'm gonna use this one so what I can do is to add the test, the test here, right? Something like product launch heaven, right? Right here and write a subheading that makes sense and then put a button here that links to payment and put a picture of something that represents what exactly I'm selling. And I just have to replace all of these tests, right? I just have to replace all of these tests. So if you think of a landing page, how a landing page should be, you would see that a landing page, you have the hero section that contains your product details. It should have what exactly people are gonna be getting if they, if they decide to take, if they decide to um, buy your product. And also it should contain some testimonies, testimonials of people who have bought your product before and call to actions. When I mean call to actions, I mean buttons that users, users can click and then can take action. Right, so hope you're getting it so far. So now we have a product, a database that we're going to be giving to people. And then now we have the place where we have the website that we're gonna share on the internet for people to assess this database. To be, to be able, for people to be able to see exactly what we're giving them if they take this database. And now, I, I, I'm pretty sure you know that there's one, thing is mi there's one thing missing because you think, am I going to be giving this thing out for free, you know, right? So it's really missing. So what's missing is a way for you to hide this thing behind a paywall, right? So like I told you in my own story, I was uh, uh, in my own story, I could charge $19 for the database, but I'm hiding it within a paywall. So for 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 paywall, I would normally use Lemon Squeezy. Lemon Squeezy to do that. I'm excuse to do this or I would use Gumroad. So Gumroad is super easy to sell, super easy to st start with. They both have the same, um, they both have the same feel. So I'm just going to go to this Gumroad dashboard. They both have the same feel and they give you the same everything. So you can see the way your products will align on uh, Gumroad. So if you click on products, you can say new product. So this is an, a new account. Click on new product and it's going to ask you what type of product, Twitter product course, ebook, membership, physical product, or bundle. So I'm just gonna say it's a digital product and I'm gonna call it product launch case study, right? As I'm gonna call it. And I'm gonna put a price, 19.99, and I'm gonna say customize. So the thing is that I know when you think of SaaS, you're thinking of something that people can pay you monthly, but really they are, a lot of things have changed these days. You can actually charge weekly, you can charge daily, you can charge monthly, and you can charge yearly, and you can charge a one-time fee, right? A one-time fee. So you're charging a one-time fee because it's your first time in the game. It's your first time in the size game, and you just want to do something that is pretty easy. But really, you can have this database right if you're always updating this updating this database all the time you're always adding you're always moving you can actually charge monthly fee a very affordable monthly fee maybe six dollar a month for people to have access to this database so i'm going to add um description right description right here and uh this is my url so i'm going to say product launch heaven right right here i copy the url and i can put my cover photo i can put my thumbnail i can put personal info over here but um i don't want to add all of those things to it right i don't want to add all of those things to it i would say publish and continue right there so now this is the product 
but I didn't add any other thing, right? This is the product that I want to sell. And if I, I'm going to copy this product, right? Take it and I'll take it to um, the site that I'm going to, that I'm going to be creating, click on the button, right? And click on the button and I'll put this URL over here and I'll say done. Right. So the thing is, whenever a person clicks on this button, this call to action right here that says um, maybe buy now, uh, buy now, it comes, it goes to this this particular site, this particular site, which is Gumroad, and then they have to click on I want this. So when they click on I want this, they are able to just check out. So they put in the city total, right? The city total, and they, once they click on payment, they can make this payment. And that's all they have to do. So do you understand? So we have three things here. We have the database where we're putting the product, right? And then we have um, we have the landing page where we're sharing info about the product. And then we have uh, a merchant that is helping us handle payment, right? So if you come back here, there's something that we did not do right here. It's something that we did not do on the product side of things. Uh, when the person finished buying the product, everything is supposed to go somewhere right they're supposed to go somewhere right so that's why we'll have to add it over here so i have to say content right content um so we can we can add this content here right but i'm pretty sure there's a way we can add it here so i'm just going to try again right here uh cover to know product info summary um call out yeah we can call out the important features consider the amount right so we can also allow customers to pay whatever they want to pay and okay so i think this really changed the bit this really changed the bit so before now there's a space where you can put in your the link to the products you want to sell uh, i think this really changed the bit but we're just going to have it here uh yes the link to your to your product launch heaven right so this is the link to the product uh, to the product launch heaven right this is the link right here and we'll come back here on uh we'll come back here and just click on share and we'll say create link share publicly and we'll just copy this particular link so this is the link that we're going to give to all these users right so we'll come back here to uh product hunt and just highlight and just add the link to it right that's it so if you want to add more um, if you want to add more this is to it it's fine then we just go ahead and say save changes and that's all we have to do so when people buy they can actually just go to the once they buy they click on the next link they can then come back to this table and then they have access to the product that you're giving them so once you're comfortable with all of this you can come to a place like twitter and start tweeting about the products you know you can start tweeting about the products start tweeting about what you're doing and uh you know start tweeting about what you're doing start telling people what your product does and start sharing the benefits of your product and you would see that you'll be able to make your first sales in real time so hope you've learned something today if you have questions leave it in the comment section and i'll do how to answer you thank you very much for watching i'll see you in another tutorial thank you Thank you so much.